Hey guys, what's up? Ross done. Uh, I just wanted to make a very quick, short video um, about today's announcement from uh, Total Biscuit that his uh, his cancer has returned. Um, it's in his liver. Um, his own prognosis isn't great, um, and it's it's pretty shocking. I'm not the world's biggest Total Biscuit fan. Uh, I don't even think I subscribe to his channel. <laughs> but uh, every time I watch one of his videos, I think it's funny. I think it's informative. I've always enjoyed his wit. I've always appreciated the Total Biscuit. Is um, He's a really good example of a self-made YouTube star. Um, his videos get millions of views around the world. Uh, he has nothing but positive support from most people. Um, he has, uh, I've dealt with cancer in my own family. Um, I've had people I love, people I care about taken from me um, as a result of the disease. Um, it runs in my family. It's a concern for me in the future. I think the thing that really sh scares the shit out of me with Total Biscuit is he's like two or three years older than me. Um, whenever somebody who you have some sort of empathy for or common ground with is struck down with this kind of illness, it sort of shakes you a bit. Um, I don't like to sort of sit around and think about death very often. I don't like to sit around and dwell on negative things. But um, yeah, that sort of stuff hits hits real home. Uh, I think it speaks, if it speaks for anything, the likes of people like Buggy um, and, and uh, Total Biscuit sort of highlight that we as sort of gamers and people who spend an awful lot of our time in sedentary positions uh, should be a little more concerned about our own health and well-being because it's easy to sort of forget that um, you're encased in this meat stick for hopefully a good 70 to 80 years with some care and attention um, and obviously not looking after yourself can dramatically reduce the quality of your life and of course the duration of your life. Of course I'm not saying that you know Total Biscuit didn't look after himself or etc. I'm just saying that it's definitely something that we need to be conscious of uh, as people who spend a lot of our recreational time in sedentary positions. Um, I don't think people should refer to Total Biscuit in the past. He's still around. He's probably gonna still making the con make good content. He's probably still gonna be present um, but he's got a hard journey ahead of him, um, and by his own prognosis, potentially a short one. So, whilst I've never met the dude, um, I've laughed at his work. I continue to probably laugh at his work. Um, I think he's become an important spokesperson for consumer advocacy. He was very heavy on sort of video games companies that were trying to package off core components of video games as DLCs and expansions. Um... He got a lot of shit for his support of Gamergate. He got a lot of negative attention for that. It's not a subject he dwells on often, but it's a subject that he always seemed to uh, have an understanding of. Um, and I appreciate, as somebody who follows Gamergate, uh, what he's done and how he's influenced that. Um, I hope the next few years of his life, however long they are, hopefully he has many years, um, are positive. And I hope it keeps a good stiff upper lip. Um, you're a cool dude, Total Biscuit. You make me laugh. You make a lot of people laugh. Um, I wish you well. Thanks, guys. I'm Rastan.